catch the skaglet. That there's our squirming friend's lure. Pass it over if you please. I'll find a worthier owner than that gory skaghead ever was. Thanks to you, me tribe is free. That trifling trio is all eating humble dirt pie. The Ashen might have gave us light, but you gave us something better. Hope. Granny Nella caught a fish longer than Bataran's hammer once. Shame about it eating Grandpa Gog first. It made it taste a bit salty. That's a fine piece of Romar you have there. And look, not a single speck of light blight. If hounds in Romar can grow resistant to the light, perhaps we can too. You are as kind as you are strong, my friend. I'll take the horn to Silurin. But first, there's something I must tell you. Something that troubles me. Silurin has doubts about there being a cure for Bataran. She thinks our work could help others, but Bataran has been sick for too long. Why would his own sister give up hope like that? No, I won't accept it. I've spoken with Amara about it, and she told me of the Mother Scale. Geffen once gave one of her scales to her dying lover, a listener man. It restored him. Amara has traced the scale to a ruin in the Bronzed Mire. Please, we have to find it. Amara told me something else, too. That light and dark need not be at odds. I suppose Geffen's a good example of that, floating between shimmer and shadow.
It's a shame about Talaran. A great talent wasted on petty cruelty. Now give me the world seed, so that I might grind it up and brew a remedy for my fingers. This seed, an abundance of life imprisoned within a tiny cell. I shall give this life its freedom, just as you have given me mine. The history of our world is buried deep within the ash. It's an interesting exploration if you are strong enough to delve into the deep. Ahu came to me in my dreams, this time to say goodbye. Our father was there too. I've never seen them so happy. I awoke, <laughs> grinning like a fool, my cheeks wet with tears. The curse is gone. I can feel it, as surely as I can feel the light on my face. And Malik, he left something, didn't he? Please, do me this one last favor. Show it to me. This shield. It was once the symbol of our noble house. Ahu drew it for me one day. It's yours now, my friend. My family has a future again. We don't need the past. See how it captures both light and shadow. And the power. You can feel it in the air. Please, give it to me. It will take me some time to study the Mother Scale, to extract its power. Bataran has lived a long time. I only hope he can wait a little bit longer. Amara is less knowledgeable than I would have expected for a seer. I asked her to help clean a deer. She stared at me like I had grown a pair of rabbit ears. I've had my fill of the wild places. More than happy to try some civilization on for size. rest delivers what it promises a place to lay down and gaze at the light above
mine, in spirit, in body, and in the company you keep. Amara was right to offer my help, for the designs of an Elder Dark are arrayed against you. I have untangled Cisna's weave, so we can see what she was trying to hide from us. The Shadow of the Ashen. It was he who scavenged the human heart. He clutches it like a lost child to his breast, deep within the palace of Lathyrus. Take it from him, and then bring both hearts to my most sacred of pools. Amara knows where.